Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Welcome to another MechSpecs.com video presentation. Tonight's presentation, we're covering a user build. This one is done by Blagzir. It's called the Firestarter. I'm not quite sure why, since there are no flamers on it, but it does have enough lasers that if you get near anything that's an ordinary combustible, I'm sure it will light up. Uh, the piloting in the combat drop tonight is done by Ian Sane. So, you know, he's got his little quirky comments and things like that going on. You may want to watch it once to see how the the build does and then watch it a second time just to get a laugh at some of his comments. But the speed here says 81. It's 89.1 with speed tweak, um, 51.19 firepower, 1.24 heat efficiency. This thing requires fairly advanced uh, gunnery skills. You've got to have some good heat discipline with this. Standard armor, 384 to 422 endo steel internals. Four medium lasers, two large pulse lasers, AMS, two machine guns, um, and you've got an XL325 engine in here. So it is fairly expensive. That's not the standard engine. I think all in all the mech costs about six and a half million C bills, something like that. We're going to go over the loadout placement because it is actually fairly important. The large pulse lasers are stuck in the arms because of the higher gun mount. So you want to maximize your damage by minim and minimize your profile while attacking the enemy. So you can hide behind ridges and things like that and still use your large pulse lasers. So in each arm, you've got a large pulse laser, a machine gun, and one double heat sink. In the right torso, you've got two medium lasers, two double heat sinks. In the heads, where you're storing one ton of machine gun ammo. Center torso, you've got uh, your XL325, and you filled up all internal slots, three heat sinks, double heat sinks in there. Your left torso's got your AMS, two medium lasers, two double heat sinks, and the AMS ammo is actually stuck down in one of the legs. You can put it in either one. It doesn't matter. Armor, <clears throat> the layout, you know, you can fairly well max this mech out. Uh, 384 out of 422 is... A very high amount of armor and all the armors in your upper body you've ma maxed out every section of your upper body's armor maximum amount the legs not so critical hopefully you'll be able to use cover and things like that when um, stalking your prey but definitely pay attention that you've only got approximately uh, two-thirds on your legs so that's something to pay attention to now, with the actual combat drop here, like I said, this is being done by Ian Sane. Take a look at the comments. Take a look at the video. If you like what you see, go to MechSpec, subscribe. I don't know. There's a subscribe button somewhere here on the channel, whatever works for you. But anyway, we're back doing videos again, so there you have it. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Target acquired. New target acquired. New target acquired. Missile. 
Warning, incoming missile. Warning, incoming missile. Target acquired. Critical. New target acquired. Heat level critical. Critical damage. New target acquired. Acquired. New target acquired. New target acquired.
Sleep level critical.